How about that? Huh? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Now he's hungry. Okay. Oh, oh. What's up, little girl? Oh. Now I'm sad again. Oh, her dad came back. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, she was awesome. Uh, here's a pirate dress up kit. It's the clothes off my back. <laughs> Yay, present! Look at her go. Good lord. Uh, yeah, I don't think he's trying to be funny. And then they leave. Oh. Uh, Okay. Damn it. Don't break the fourth wall and tell me why you have to charge me. I, I just understand, you know? Um, I do have enough for the speed star, but I, yeah, I don't want that kind of stuff right now. Um, what kind? Uh, do you have anything good in, in your. Ex yes, we've been over this about you breaking the fourth wall. Do you have any accessories that I want? No, you have the same stuff that uh, Maison mad. Yes, break the fourth wall again just so I can look at the gear parts. Okay, everything's tuned up. Do, I, do you have anything to buy? Oh, you do. Um, actually, let's see if I can tune up the engine. Uh, six output. No, see, that's worse. And 2500 HP, I have 32. No, see, that. look. We're already better than than what she sells here. 2700, well, that's the same. And then MS7.5, nope, not better. And in terms of weapons, she's got the Iron G Whip, which he's already got. And parts. Um, I, I can't afford any of them because they're freaking expensive. Um, do I have anything to sell? I do! One snapper! Do I have any parts? Uh, I want to keep those. Just in case. Yeah, yeah, we've been over that. Alright, before I go to the planning room, I do want to go over here. It is Bart from The Simpsons. Good lord. I'm just gonna go inside. I don't care. Because he's got an iron whip in here. Yeah, a little boy and girl. Oh. Uh, stop. No. I, I, it, it wasn't me. I wasn't in your room, dude. Nah. It was cool. Alright, the planning room is back over here, by the way. Where we talk to those guys on the computer. Really? Because I thought it was slot machines, to be honest. Yeah, Sig did it all! I don't do anything around here, I just destroy ships. Plus, I'm a prince, so everybody lets me get away with it. Um, my bad. You gotta tell me that kind of stuff. My special file. <laughs> no, not that one, the other one. Oh, crap. Now everybody knows my secret. And, what the hell? That looks like a giant gear. Okay, 500 years old. So 500 years ago, they had... That's just King Fatima? And he's making a blood oath with giants. I say they're gears. 500 years old, a scroll. We have stuff older than that. Um, it would if he didn't steal it. Oh no, his father just had it. Next! Wow, I mean, this is just a giant projector screen, apparently. 
he forced the giants into slumber? So, obviously they're talking about the gears. One of the giants is called the Great Fatima Treasure. What about the Jasper? <laughs> now you start to get suspicious. Of course. Just now. Uh, just kidding. I totally trust you, you totally new guy. Of course he's looking for it. Everybody's looking for it. We must rescue Marguerite. You told me not to step the screen, step on the screen, and then you freaking walk across it. What the hell, dude? Um, y you you want us to help? Of of course, you want us to help rescue Marguerite. That's all you've been talking about since we got here, apparently. How about it? Uh, yes, room and board can be very expensive. Yeah, I'm kind of one of those silent main characters for a lot of the time here. Your strength alone is greater than 10 or 20 of Shikhan's guards. Yeah, I can do it. And he goes emo? I don't want to fight. I want to just sit in my room and play my chemical romance and Fallout Boy and, and and that's it. And then dye my hair black and paint my fingernails. And then he storms off. Yeah, he doesn't want to fight. He destroyed his village, dude. He hasn't had himself a good cry yet. You need a good cry every once in a while. Oh, there's little girls. Or I think girl? I'm gonna go with a girl and a boy. It's hard, hard to say that. Come on, if kids don't cheer you up, what will, dude? Oh, they ran off though. So we can't do anything. Uh, I want to go back. Let's go back in his room. No. Can I wait? Yeah, on the bed? No. Ah, I thought there was something I could do here. Oh, what the hell? I have to be sneaky. He suddenly explodes in anger. <laughs> yeah, he tends to do that. Uh, you're lucky that it was just emotionally right now. He would be fun to fight. If I lie and wait under the elevator. What? He wants to fight me? Like seriously? Fine. You want, you want, you want a piece of me? Let's do this. Go down. Come on, dude. We can do this. I will take you on. Longest elevator ride ever. We're finally there. Where is... He wasn't waiting for me under the elevator at all. And I wanted to talk. To oh, snap. Yeah. Do you want to talk about it? Uh, no. Um, because I'm emo and you're kind of gay looking from, or at least your sprite is from behind. Just a bit. You're not... Whatever. Whoa! How, how do you stand on that thing? I don't like fighting like you do. 
I don't like to fight, I'm just awesome at it. He's got a freaking whip and I could kick his ass. You know that? You've only got one death blow. I've got two already. Yeah, I don't like fighting either. Nobody likes to fight. Why don't you leave me alone? I could use that. If I fight, people die. I don't want anybody to die. No more death ever, ever again. It's possible if I just stop fighting. I don't think everybody wants to run away from reality at one point or another. You've, you've said that before. Sure, that happened because you were in the gear, but even if you hadn't, people would have died. You weren't the reason. War. You know, the people who started the war are the reason. And unless you get rid of the reason, nothing will change. I fight to get rid of the reason. Right now, there is no other way, so I have to fight. But that doesn't mean I enjoy it. That was one of the best speeches in the game so far. And of course, Faye like, probably won't hear a damn word of it. And I know why you don't want to harm others, but if you don't want to make it up to those children, if you want to make it up to those children, don't you have to fight? You do have a reason to fight. A reason you must fight! But as long as you ignore it and continue to run away, those, these, those kids will never forgive you. Just remember that. And another thing, I'm not saying that not helping me is running away. You don't have to help. This is my own problem. I don't want to get you in. Yeah. Great speech, dude. 